in Reno. You're watching 2 News at 5.30. I feel whole again with my baby back. <laughs> From Reno to New Zealand, a man and his best friend are finally reunited tonight. The exclusive reunion video tops 2 News <laughs> at 5.30. Nine months and almost 7,000 miles later, Cheyenne and Reggie reunited Aww. just on Sunday. I'm Landon Miller. And I'm Kristen Remington. A lot of people were waiting for this. Mm -hmm. In fact, um, some folks out of Fallon who watch us regularly have right. emailed me many times Seeing what's saying, happening. come on, we want an update. We want an update. Well, Liz has that update. It's a reunion that was only made possible by you, our Northern Nevada viewers. You helped raise thousands of dollars to transport uh, within just hours really of the original right. story airing back in March. Elizabeth Alveda joins us here in the studio and Liz, can you give us just a quick recap of this story? Yeah, Kristen. Well, Reggie first lived here in Reno, but he moved back to his native New Zealand back in January after he could no longer afford his health care here. He made the hard decision to leave Cheyenne behind, but his good friend Michelle Fossum helped to raise enough money to reunite the pair. We have that reunion video right here in a story you'll see only on two. Hi, this is Reggie, and we have Cheyenne back in New Zealand. Reggie Boyd raised Cheyenne since she was a puppy. This year, he moved across the Pacific Ocean without her. Sunday was the first time he'd seen her in nine months. Cheyenne! Oh! Hello, sweetie! Hello, darling! Hello. He was just on like a little kidney candy store. And by the looks of it, Cheyenne was just as excited. Kicking her back legs are just going all over the place. She does not know what to do. I've never seen her so animated. Cheyenne landed in New Zealand almost two weeks ago, but New Zealand law required her to stay in quarantine for 10 days before release. And a big thanks to the Takanini quarantine. They've done a great job. Yeah. Sunday, they finally loaded up for their seven hour drive home. He cried. He was walking her to the car. My daughter overheard him say, Cheyenne, you're home now. You're home, honey. And it's clear she now feels right at home. There she is sitting on the on the couch there next to me, settled in well and playing with her duck and lamb chop. So she's um, one happy camper. If there was ever a definition of true best friends, it was Reggie and Cheyenne. Reggie says he owes it all to Michelle Fossum and her family, VCA Lakeside Animal Hospital, and most of all, you, the Northern Nevada community who made it all possible. It's just so great to have Cheyenne home, and I can't thank those people enough that donated uh, to bring Cheyenne back. I'm in your debt. I just appreciate it so much. She's quite at peace, and I feel whole again. Now, Michelle did have just under $300 left from the $8,000 raised on the GoFundMe. She's donating that to the VCA Lakeside Animal Hospital to help less fortunate animals on behalf of Cheyenne and Reggie. Now, for the full reunion video, you can visit our KTVN News app. Covering the big story live in the studio, Elizabeth Olveda, 2 News.